All right, what's going on, dudes, and welcome back to another episode of Ultra Modded Survival. You may be wondering why I'm not still in the Twilight Forest. Don't worry, I'll head back in just a moment. But I was thinking as we go through the stronghold, I'm probably going to get a lot of loot. And rather than having to decide what I want to throw out, what I want to keep, or having to come back and forth a whole bunch, put stuff in the chest so I can clear out my inventory so I can go collect more, it would be easier if we could come up with a solution to remedy the problem on site. And I had mentioned last time, I think, that someone brought up the idea of, of making another ender chest so I could set that down when I'm wherever in any dimension, throw items in that I want to send back here, and they will just go because they'll end up in this ender chest here as long as they have the same color combo, and then they get pumped through here into this chest and into the ME system, you know the drill. So yeah, I've got uh, some ender chest resources in my inventory here. That's why I came back to the overworld. I've also put some uh, some potions of night vision in my inventory. I do apologize on, on the last episode. It was hard to see at some points, and I didn't really think about that. So yeah, my bad for that. And I, I just figure for the sake of, of making the video viewable, um, it'd just be easier if I, I give myself some potions of night vision so you can see everything. I could adjust my gamma all the way up, but I actually kind of like there being the, the dark and the lights at, between night and day. So I, I figure it's just a better temporary solution to use uh, potions of night vision. Anyway, I'll do that in the future. Um, and again, my bad on that was not my intention to make it impossible to, to see things because on my screen it's, it's fairly easy to, to see even when it's dark, but uh, it doesn't come across that well in the in the video on YouTube. So anyway, that said, let's go ahead and make the ender chest, which boom, and oh, gotta be in the workbench to bring up the question mark. There we go. Okay. I think I have everything I need. Went out and fetched it at least. Okay, there we go. I mined a, a little bit of obsidian as well and, and just got a, a few extra pieces because I always end up needing to go uh, mine out more whenever we need to make something new out of obsidian. So, you know, let's just have a little bit extra in, in reserve. And then I guess we'll place it down and uh, we will color, which one is it? Uh, the leftmost one green. Okay. And put that right there. Cool. So now I'm hoping this will work between Twilight Forest and, and, uh, and Overworld, assuming that the chunk loader is good to go. Um, the, uh, the quarry ran out of fuel. It looks like you are not pumping any more items, so I guess we may as well throw some more fuel in there. Anyway, all right, let's, uh, oh wait, does that actually open both at the same time? I heard two, uh, I thought I heard two chest opening sounds. I don't know if it works that way. Anyway, uh, do I destroy you with an ax or a pickaxe? Which is faster? I can never remember with the, the ender chest, especially because this isn't even a vanilla one, but regardless. Okay, so let's, um, I, Threw my buckets back in here, so let me grab one, and uh, we will just kickstart the quarry once more, and then we'll run back into the Twilight Forest, head back to the stronghold, which uh, should be really easy. I, I set up my my portal gun portal so we can just zoom on back there real quickly, and uh, shouldn't be no big deal. Okay, so let's start you again, and I guess we'll just do a couple buckets in there. That should keep it going for a little while. It may be actually getting close to the, the very bottom. It's gotten pretty far down there. Um, anyway, all right. I think it's about time that we head back into the stronghold and loot it up. Oh yeah. Okay, so let's see. We want to go over to the Twilight Forest portal. Do I have everything I need in order to make this an enjoyable endeavor? Uh, let me toss the bucket back. I'm, I'm just, despite the fact that this is hopefully going to remedy the, the inventory situation, I, I do want to keep my inventory as clean as possible going on in. And uh, the night vision potions are not helping, sadly. All right. Anyway, every time I hit R, it just messes up my inventory sorting. Um, there were a lot of comments on the last video. Uh, debating whether or not I well lots of lots of people saying that I should use my uh, what you call it my my ultimate weapons lots of people saying that those would be unbalanced and I should keep doing what I'm doing it's really difficult man trying to please people it really is <laughs> I'm doing my best that's all I can really say um, maybe I, I might go through as we're fighting like the tedious dudes that we've fought a whole bunch I may um I may I'm gonna leave my portals like this if I ever want to get out of the stronghold um, for the sake of getting new armor or something, because my chest plate's actually almost worn out. Um, but I may, like the little minion dudes, I may just take those out because they're they're kind of tedious. 
Um, but as far as the boss goes, I will fight that with the diamond sword because I do want to keep the battle as uh, as vanilla as it was meant to be. It, not vanilla, but just as the mod sort of intended for it to be. Anyway, let's check this out. Uh, let's try to get some sort of drop of some sort from someone. Has anybody want to be a guinea pig? Hello, anybody home? I guess I could just destroy a block. It would be as easy as that. All right, let's do that. And then let's put down the ender chest. Okay, and let's see if this works. Oh, oh, it's definitely working. Oh, it's working. Definitely. Yeah, go. Yes, works. Uh. Actually, I wonder if I should have the quarry going because it's going to... It's not actually that taxing on the, the chest, but that's legit. Okay, so this is even better than a backpack, because with the backpacks, it was like a, a kind of a temporary solution, but I'd still have to empty them out and go through all of them eventually. With this, once I fill up my inventory, just boom, 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 it's like throwing it in a backpack, except it all goes into the inventory system immediately, which is kind of amazing. All right, so potion of night vision time. Let's do it. Oh, so much better. You guys can see now. <laughs> Fantastic. Okay, so yeah, I guess as I'm fighting like the normal dudes, I can use the uh, the ultimate bow and stuff. But when it gets to the uh, the more boss battle type dudes, I do want to do that as intended. So anyway, um, I guess let's... I mean, we don't really have to worry much about getting lost in here because we do have our, our portal gun. So yeah, I guess let's just uh, let's dive on in. See what happens. Mm-hmm. This, I mean, you can see on the mini map, this place is huge, and there's like a whole bunch of stuff going on, and I don't like what the. Oh, hi, helmet crabs. Hi there. How's it going? I am just gonna go ahead and take out your spawner for you. Not a big deal, you know. Just gonna do what I'm gonna do. Bye bye. Bye bye. Oh, you dropped fish. Oh, bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. And let me remove this from existence real quick, if you don't mind. All right. Cool. Oh, we got a loot room. Oh, we got a loot room. Let's see. Um, well, let's mine on in, I guess. Cool, cool. Gonna have to take out some some head crabs. Hey, no, bad, bad head crab. All right, let's take you out, and there we go. What do we have in here? We have a steel leaf sword, maze wafers, and what do we have in here? Oh, hey, that'll do better than our current diamond sword. So. Fair enough, why not? It's actually way better. Okay, that's pretty cool. Um, and then see if we want to clear out an inventory, then just boom, and then we just go boom, 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 boom. It's gonna load it up, it, hopefully, it, oh, okay, good. The output is, is it's faster than the input, which is good. Okay, we can throw our iron bars in, we can even throw our old diamond sword in, we can throw our, I'm not gonna keep the glass bottle because that wasn't actually, uh, wait. Oh, I guess it can't pump, huh. Can it not pump items with damage values? I guess not. That's interesting. Oh, that... What? No, no. What? I... It disappeared. I hope that didn't go into oblivion. I'm not going to put items with damage values any longer into the chest. I, that might have something to do with the... No, it doesn't have anything to do with the ME bus cable because this has nothing... This doesn't pump directly into... The, I don't know what's going on, but that's okay. It's cool. We're, we're fine. Um, anyway... <laughs> Still some mysteries taking place here. Let's grab the ender chest back. But this is the cool. This is the cool. You can't tell me this is not the coolest thing. Just being able to place an ender chest down and and put all items into the ME system. Just I'm hoping we don't fill up too quickly. We do have a, a few more spaces to add on more little drives and uh, and we can also um, and we can also expand and add more uh, big drives that that hold the little mini hard drives as well. I think. I think. I think, I think. Hmm. So I'm trying to, trying to, oh, hi everyone. Oh God, they're jumping up and stuff. Nope. See ya. And see ya. And see ya. And bye-bye. Bye-bye, bye-bye. I fought a lot of you. We're just gonna, we're just gonna blaze on right through ya and, and uh, head on, try to find the boss, which I'm trying to look for like an icon on the map that would be indicative of such a thing, but uh, I can't find and I wonder mm, maybe the ooh do we have some NPCs in here having a conversation what are you guys talking about none of you are facing oh you oh you are face oh you're kind of just he's turning his head he's like yo what's up this is a pretty creepy dungeon yeah yeah man I'm kind of nervous in here I don't I don't I've been down here for a while because I don't have legs and can't really move yeah me too man it's kind of it's kind of not, not really fun down here I mean how, how we we should try to like plan an escape I mean, how are, we, how are we gonna do that, though, if we don't have legs? I mean, I, I, don't, I don't know what you're getting at, man. I don't... 
Yeah, you do bring up a good point. And that's all for their, their conversation. Kind of a dead-end conversation. Like, nothing really came out of that. He just kind of realized, oh, I don't have legs, and therefore it's going to be a problem. So, oh, well. These, these things do happen. <laughs> you know, most, some conversations, they, they, do just, they do just dead end. Uh, oh, hey, we could. We could just dive on down to the next level down here. Yeah, that's a really good plan. And hi. See ya. Hi, bye. Okay, let's see. I mean, there's got to be like an icon somewhere for the boss. Um, I, I think the boss... Actually, wait. I can't remember. I was reading up on what the boss is, but I... I I can't remember if it was like just a, a spirit that, that makes things fly through the room or if there's actually one of those like night things, but a, a more decked out version of, of them. I don't know. Anyway, not as much loot as I, I thought there was going to be, but even so, having the ender chest is, hey, speaking of loot, uh, hmm, I mean, I guess, oh, charm of keeping is good. Blue wool, coal. Arrows. Hey, 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 hey. Oh, he's putting down. Hey, he almost ruined the chest. That wouldn't have been very nice. Why would you want to do that? And see ya. Oh, look at that. I don't want to pick up the items, so. Except maybe the chest. And maybe the. Maybe every. Why not? Why not? We Not like we have inventory spaces limitation at this point. We have our entire ME system. Alright, head crabs. It's actually more of a hermit crab, but you know, it's cool. You call it what we call it whatever we want. So okay, anyway, bye bye, bye bye. See, ya. oh god, what are you? Oh, a lower god. Hey, you're you've been separated from your upper body. That's a that didn't accomplish much except for you getting your head on the ground. <laughs> okay, so I, I guess you can't you can't mine through the levels. So that rules that out. I, I was thinking of maybe doing that, but uh, nope, don't think so. Oh, this is a. Mm. It's like a spawner. Oh, go Oh, is this the? Hold on. I don't know if this is the boss. Is this the boss? Is this the? I think this might be the boss. All right. Well, we found the boss. Hey there. Hi. Hold on. Hold on. I didn't realize we'd already found the boss. That was a, that was quicker than I had thought. So, okay. And they all have thirty. This must be the boss. They all have thirty-five. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. There are a lot of them. There are a lot of them, and they're all throwing axes in my face. It'd be nice if you wouldn't do that. Like, I, I wouldn't mind, like, if you wouldn't throw axes at my face. I did not think it was going to be this easy to f find the dudes. Hey, whoa, I killed one. Woohoo! And am I going to kill another? hi -ya -ya. They've Oh, they have skeleton heads inside them. That's interesting. And... Ow, 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 ow. Okay, hold on, hold on. Hold on, let's calm it down. Let's calm it down. And only three left. Yo, 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 and Dunzo. And, and, oh, there we, oh, God, oh, he's, oh, he's mad. Oh, that must be the big boss, dude. Hut, ow. And, okay, taken out, taken out. How we doing, how we doing? Oh, he keeps regen, is he, he's the big boss, dude. Uh-oh. Well, let's get his other minion. Let's get his, ow, it hurts. Stop hurting me. Okay. It's just you and me. It's just you and me, buddy. That's all there. Oh, 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 he's mad. He's throwing axes. I got this. I got this. I got this. Is he gonna keep regen? No, you're not gonna re. You can't regen from this. You can't regen from this. Your own. You're done, Zod. I can turn into him even. Ah. Uh, wait, maybe that wasn't the boss. Hold on. I'm gonna have to look it up on the wiki because there's not. You're, there's supposed to be like a whole bunch of loot that drops when you kill that the the boss dude from here and. Or maybe it did say work in progress on all their damage indicators, so maybe it's it could be a bug. Uh, I'm just gonna check really quickly uh, as to whether or not that was the boss, or if that was just like an intermediate event kind of thing. And night vision wore out. Okay, so uh, I'll be right back. So yeah, that was definitely the night phantom who is the boss for this stronghold. But unfortunately, according to the wiki, he's supposed to drop a treasure chest with loot in it once you beat him, and that didn't happen. Sad face. Work in progress. Bugs do happen, I suppose. I. I Looked in here and thought, I don't know, maybe the chest spawn inside of one of the, the crypts. I guess I could try the other. But it doesn't seem like it's very likely. Because the wiki said spawns in the middle of the arena, and the middle of the arena would be that block right there, and there is nothing. Mm. Darn it. All right, well, I guess we don't get any rewards. We just got the satisfaction of taking out the, uh, the night boss. I'm curious, like, this, this place is huge, and I'm curious if... We just got really lucky and stumbled upon him, at, like, immediately, or if there are, like, a, a bunch of them around here. 
whatever. Anyway, I don't. I I doubt it would increase the chances of us actually getting a, a loot chest if we were able to to spawn another. Anyway, so it's probably a bug. Oh well. Anyway, on that note, uh, we didn't even need to use our other potions of night vision, but I'll, I'll keep those uh, just in case we get into a, a dark place. Further on, um, I, I, I don't know, is it worth, yeah, we could drink another one and, and look around for just a few minutes to see if there's any more loot that we can find. Why not? All right, let's check it out. Let's check it out. We'll spend uh, a, a few more minutes and then we'll head back to the overworld, which we can do at any moment with our poodle gun. Yeah, I guess, I think we just got really lucky and we stumbled upon the uh, the boss, like, just really quickly, because this, this place is huge. When I stumbled upon it and I, I was looking at the unloaded chunks, it was like, Oh god, I'm never gonna, I'm never ever gonna find this place, uh, or the room where the dude is. Anyway, alright, I guess, uh, yeah, let's head back to the overworld. Why not, uh, oh, hi, is there diamond in there? Hold on, I think I saw some diamond. There is, in fact, diamond in there, and I'm a blaze man, so I don't really care about lava. I can also just do that. <laughs> Please don't fall in the lava, fall into my sweet inventory. Okay, cool. Back to... What I have, I think orange is what I want to put down, and that'll pick us out here. Okay, cool, cool. And easy peasy lemon squeezy. Off we go. Alright. Well, that was a that was a much more brief adventure than I figured it would be, but uh we were efficient. The game just was not quite as efficient in, in giving us what we deserved for our hard work. Oh well. Alright. Well, let's uh toss stuff back into here. Uh, there's some stuff I, I don't think I need like that and that, and I guess I can toss some, uh, I don't need the almost broken thing here, I guess I can throw my night vision in there, toss out the glass bottles because they're not exactly mine considering that uh, I gave myself the night vision potions. Okay, throw that out and throw those out and that and that, I guess I could have used the stone slabs, but whatever. And that and okie dokie. We good, we good, but I will carry around the um, the ender chest wherever I go because it's my new best friend and makes life a lot easier. It would allow us to, to stay in, in, what's it called, like the robot dimension for a real long time. But uh, anyway, okay, throw that in and, oh, fish. I wanna put that in the food chest. All right, cool. Well, I guess it's ender dragon time, so, um, you know, I might call this episode here. Hopefully you've enjoyed. If you have a rating, would be much appreciated. Other than that, I guess, uh, yeah, when we next join up, uh, I'll make some Eyes of Ender and, and search for a stronghold, get into the end, and uh, and yeah. Then we can get some Endstone, and we can grow some Ender Lilies and, and stuff. It'll be great. All right, thanks for watching, everyone, and I'll see you next time.